Hi everyone! In this video I will share with you some sketching and the process of making a unified color palette for my new oil painting series. After replacing the floor in my apartment, we still have uh, scraps of plywood. I asked my husband to cut one board into six pieces. They are different sizes, but it doesn't matter for my purpose. Then I sanded the surface and covered it uh, with an acrylic primer. I repeated the same process for three times, also covering the sides of each piece excepting the back. My goal was to achieve a very smooth surface uh, like on gesso board, which I adore painting on. A big advantage of uh, such a rather thick plywood is the fact that it doesn't lose its shape after applying a primer to it. I also want to find some hardware in one of my local hardware stores to make the same surface to paint on. On these boards I want to create a macabre oil painting series with some gloomy and atmospheric scenes. I created a Pinterest board a couple of years ago and named it Witchy. You know guys, it's always a big source of inspiration for me. Here, in the beginning of the video, I tried to create a complementary color palette I'm gonna use because all the references I use are very different and at the same time I don't want this series to be too grim. Therefore, some of the images will be in turquoise tones and some will be combined with this theme of fire and orange color. Here I leave you for listening to some good music and enjoying the sketching process. Oh my, <laughs> this sketch was the trickiest for me and I spent about 40 minutes on it. It's a very long time, trust me, <laughs> for me at least. And what about this lady? I just traced her. That's why there is no spin paint. Yes, I used carbon paper. It was so annoying, she didn't turn out well and it's impossible to erase a pencil on this surface, so I did what I did. No regrets. Anyway, thank you all for stopping by, stay inspired and have a nice day.